Good morning. I'm Janelle Varela with your morning digital news brief for this Tuesday, October 12th. The corruption trial of labor leader John Doherty and Philadelphia City Council member Bobby Heenan will continue today. The city's streets commissioner is expected to take the stand this afternoon. And officials have updated the COVID-19 vaccination policy for the Philadelphia Marathon. In-person runners at all marathon weekend events will now be required to promote to provide proof that they're fully vaccinated. A negative COVID test result will no longer be accepted. Because of the change, the Duncan Munchkin Kids Run has also been canceled. And today is the deadline to register to vote in New Jersey. It's also the state's final gubernatorial debate. Tonight at 8 o'clock, Democratic Governor Phil Murphy will face off against Republican Jack Cittarelli at Rowan University for the 60-minute debate. The two will be battling it out in the general election on November 2nd. Shifting to our forecast now, Larissa, another cloudy day on SAP. Good morning. Good morning to you, Janelle. Yeah, it's been dreary over the last several days, and we are continuing this stagnant pattern on this Tuesday. We're talking late day clearing possible here in Philadelphia. A better shot to see more breaks of sun, though, if you're up north in the Poconos, Lehigh Valley region. Now, if you are along the shore, in fact, anywhere in South Jersey, clouds will be a bit more stubborn to clear. Spotty showers also cannot not be ruled out and temperatures along the shore will remain in the low 70s and speaking of the shore a coastal flood advisory remains in effect we're talking Atlantic County down towards Cape County and central and southern Delaware it's also included in this advisory until 5 p.m. where we could see minor coastal flooding the next seven days look like this talk about a summer warm-up we are going to be summer like starting tomorrow Wednesday with these temperatures Temperatures more reminiscent of early June and not mid October, Janelle. Oh boy, all right. Thank you, Larissa. And remember, you can always get Larissa's most up to date forecast and the latest stories right here on CBSPhilly.com. That's the latest for your morning digital brief. I'm Janelle Burrell. Have a great Tuesday.